a friend or a source, as they say, uh, <laughs> has said that there is a spark between the pair, but that they are taking things slowly. And this comes a year. Uh, almost a year after Tom sadly lost his wife Linda to cancer. Do you think it's nice? He might I think have it's found nice. Love. I mean, they've both lost their loved ones. Mm. I mean, I know Priscilla lost Elvis mm. years and years ago, and she's had a few people over the years. But I think that they're both. It's nice to see someone, <laughs> someone of the same age dating yes. each well, other. Can I, can I bring it down to a more <laughs> basic level? When uh, Priscilla was on this very show a few weeks ago, we winkled out of her the um, astonishing statement that her Elvis, all the times they were together, He'd never seen her in her underwear and uh, she only entered the bedroom more or less fully clothed and slid between the sheets. A bit like me then. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've got... Uh, I don't know if Sir Tom Jones is hoping that this is going to go any further, but it doesn't exactly fit his image with women chucking their pants. It's it? not unusual or something like that. Oh, no. The thing is, I, I think that they go way back to Vegas days because yeah. Tom on The Voice is always saying, of course, you haven't met Elvis. You didn't meet him, did yeah. you? But I did. <laughs> so, obviously, he totally admired Elvis. And Elvis was so huge in Vegas at the same time Tom was there. So I think they've probably known each other for a long time. And probably Tom is a deep, deep fan of Elvis. He just wants to talk to her about Elvis. But, but 